hey guys welcome back to the channel and in this video we are going to talk about the mockups what is mockup so as you know that by publishing the apps on play store we upload this kind of a screenshot which looks a quite bit beautiful so how we can design this screenshot so you know to, to make this design quickly and make it easier we have tools called app mockup studio which i'm using from last three years and is totally free Okay, so as you can see that this kind of template you can easily use for your app development or publishing on the on the Play Store or App Store. All right, so let's talk about the app mockup. So as you know that uh, while up uploading the files on Play Store or while uploading the apps on Play Store, we are required to upload the image for a different screen size, like it could be a phone size or tab size. So if you're doing with the Photoshop, like if you're taking a screenshot and updating with the Photoshops, that will consume a lot of time because you will do for the first of Android, like it's for a smaller device, and then you will do it for the tab device and you update the text. So to make this, this simplify stuff, we have a one tool called that is called App Mockup Studio. So you can search a studio app that's mockup. So I will provide this link and also you can check it out by searching what app mockup studio. Once you search it, you'll find this uh, link uh, in the bottom. Uh, where is that link? App mockup studio. I'm, I have been using from three years. Okay, I did not find this link. So you can find. I will drop this link on the description box or in the. You can check it out. Okay, now as you can see that uh, I had taken some screenshots. So let me show you. So I had taken some screenshot like this of my app. And once I after taking my screenshot, I just click there. I just update. I, I just upload all the images here and update the title. So for, if I show you example how I do it, do it. So let's get started from scratch. How you can do it so so quickly if you are doing for your apps. So you have to visit the website studio.app-mockup.com. After that, you have to search load. You have to do control F and search for load. Load does load our free template. So as you can see that load our free template. So let me click on any one. So if I wanted to use this one. So if you click on load, once you click on load, okay. After once you click on load, you will see a this kind of template. You have to click on this screens and you can see a main screenshot has been highlighted. Screenshot one, screenshot two, it's get highlighted, and you can see that a different screen size, like Samsung, iPad, Samsung Galaxy S24, all the screens. After that, you have to click on device one. Okay. Once you click on device one, you have to scroll down and you have to click on add a screen. Once you click on add a screen, you can upload your image. So if I click on upload image, click here, you can see that the image kit appeared here. Okay. So this is how you can upload your image. So if I again click on add a screen and if I upload a second image, so let me click on open. So you can see that it's get uploaded. So this is how you can, you can create your template. And if you wanted to up, up, update your text, so let me click here. And after that, I have to update the title, right? So click on title and here you can update the title, whatever the title you want it to be. Like make AI image, generate something like that and once you're done with this you have to click on preview so you can preview that how it looks like on app store or you know a different platform like this is how you can see that or like iphone 14 pro max this is how you looks like on the samsung galaxy ipad and which looks saves you tons of time after that you can you can click on editor to go back to the editor and if you want to change the design like you can change the design as well that's totally up to you and once you're done with this click on export once you click on export you will choose like what kind of mockups you want like system pro or whatever so you to click on export so it will export that but i had already exported it so let me show you that all the mockups so this is a mockup I had downloaded. So let me show you quickly. Uh, it's doing unzip. Okay, it's get unzip and let me open this. You can see that I I had generated for Samsung Galaxy iPhone 14 Pro Max Plus, and you can see this how quick and how easy, right? So if you do it with the Photoshop, that will consume a lot of times and it become hassle for you and you become burnout. So that's why I suggest you to use these tools. And you know this is looking too beautiful. What do you think guys it's looking beautiful or not all right now let's go back here let's go to the dash let's go to the hair app mockup studio and let's suppose if you want to change the design you can click on this here you can see that we are able to change the design as well as the font family so whatever the font whatever the things you wanted to use you can use like you can just explore it by clicking on air 
so yeah so in general uh, while uploading the apps you have to add the you know uh, screenshot so you can you have to add that for that you have to uh, add the screenshot and it's become a, a quite bit uh, hectic to add that screenshot and i've been using from last three years and this makes my development quite bit uh, simpler and i think easier so if i show you store performance store list listings and where is that store settings i think oh god why i'm not able to see that store so yeah like in general i know you what do you mean like you got it so yeah so you can upload uh, you can update your images like you can see that i have i have to upload the phone screenshot tablet screenshot and the 10 inch so it become a really easier to upload that screenshots so let me know what is your thoughts on app mockup studio are you using or not i have been using from last three years and it, it has a great experience so yeah that's all in this video guys thank you bye